Today we will look at 8 planned hydrogen FC EVs with a range of up to 500 miles. Let's get right to the video. Number 8. The BMW iX5 Since introducing the BMW 750HL, a limited production hydrogen car, in the year 2000, the BMW Group has been experimenting with these vehicles. It transformed the 4th generation BMW X5 into the new BMW iX5 hydrogen fuel cell electric variant in 2021. The hydrogen fuel cell electric drivetrain for the BMW iX5 was created in collaboration with Toyota. Two 700 bar hydrogen tanks constructed of carbon fiber reinforced plastic that are part of the vehicle's driving system transform hydrogen into energy in a fuel cell. It generates up to 170 horsepower of electrical output. Contrary to what some reports suggest, the second generation Toyota Mirai's 330 cell fuel cell stack generating 170 horsepower holds the title of the most powerful fuel cell stack in the world. The fifth generation of the BMW Group's e-drive electrical motor is used in conjunction with the fuel cell stack. During the coasting overrun and braking periods, this motor functions as a generator, using the energy produced to charge the traction battery. The rear wheel's principal use for the electric motor is obvious, to spin them. It provides up to 369 horsepower. Two hydrogen tanks are presented in the iX5, one under the back seat and one in the central tunnel. The process of refueling them is comparable to that of a gasoline or diesel vehicle because it just takes 3 to 4 minutes to fill them full. According to a report from Autocar UK, the model's range is 311 miles or 500 kilometers. The Germans install a new floor assembly that enables the hydrogen tanks to be accommodated in the car. Along with regular manufacturing components, it's incorporated the unique 12 volt and 400 volt electrical systems, traction battery pack, electric motor and fuel cell. The fuel cell systems that are here, hidden under the hood are produced by an internal hydrogen competitive center in Garching, which is located north of the city of Munich. The BMW Group will begin using the iX5 as a tech demonstrator in a few places in the spring of 2023. The business has no intention of marketing this approach in showrooms. Number 7. The Honda CRV FC EV. Production of a 6th generation Honda CRV based FCEV has been approved. Performance manufacturing center PMC, a factory in Ohio that produces specialized automobiles like the Acura NSX, will be the site of production. Instead of being a standard FCEV, the Honda CRV will be a hydrogen hybrid. It will have a plug in ca capability that enables it to function also as a BEV. Customers will be able to operate it as a BEV by just plugging it into a charger, for instance, in areas with few or no hydrogen fueling faci facilities. It is realistic to expect, expect that the Honda CRV's battery pack will be bigger than those of most other fuel cell vehicles. Although we don't anticipate it to have a 300 mile range, the BEV component will probably act as a sort of temporary range extender. This model will probably resemble a PHV, but instead of using an internal combustion engine, it could combine FCEV with a BEV to produce zero emissions. According to earlier statements made by Honda, General Motors will collaborate with Honda to, to develop the fuel cell system that will power the hydrogen-powered CRV. It generates 107 horsepower or 80 kilowatts. Number 6. The INEOS Grenadier Hydrogen FCEV The partnership between INEOS Automotive and the Hyundai Motor Company to create and test a hydrogen fuel cell version of the INEOS Grenadier variant was announced in November of 2020. According to the release, the Hyundai Nexo-based South Korean automaker's second-generation fuel cell stack will likely be installed in the INEOS Grenadier hydrogen prototype. The hydrogen fuel cell prototype was identified as the Grenadier FCEV concept in a subsequent statement made by Ineos Automotive in October of 2021. The business also announced a partnership with AVL, an authority in powertrain engineering. The Grenadier fuel cell EV concept is now under development. 
by the end of 2022, online off-road testing was supposed to start, which unfortunately it hasn't happened yet. Number 5. The 2024 Hyundai Nexo The Hyundai Motor Group has recently demonstrated a greater commitment to FCEVs than any other firm, excluding the Japanese car manufacturers. In the coming years, the South Korean corporation is expected to introduce at least four cars in this class, one of which will be the new Hyundai Nexo. The company's midterm objective is to sell more than 110,000 units of its passenger and commercial FCEVs each year internationally. Hyundai Motor Company revealed that the new Hyundai Nexo will be a facelifted ver uh, version of the original model that debuted on a sale in March of 2018. Hyundai announced its intention to become a carbon neutral brand by 2045 at the 2021 Frankfurt Motor Show. When this model debuts in 2024, it will be considerably more than just a visual upgrade. The brand new fuel cell stack will come in two versions, a 135 horsepower and a 268 horsepower variant. The Nexo currently has a 612 km EPS estimated range, which is the same as roughly 380 miles. In an interview with former South Korean President Moon Jae in October of 2020, Hyundai Motor Group Chairman Chung started that the organization intended to expand it to 800 km, which is roughly 497 miles. It's reasonable to conclude that Chung was alluding to the new Nexo that would launch in 2024. Number 4. The Hyundai Staria Fuel Cell On April 13, 2021, the Hyundai Staria Fuel Cell made its debut in a teaser at the conclusion of the Staria's digital world premiere. The Staria Fuel Cell will be introduced in the second half of 2023, according to the same release. The MPV might receive the 200kW third generation fuel cell stack, which is comparable in size to the second generation system, but provides double the power. According to Hyundai Motor Company, the 200 kW variant was created for com commercial vehicles only. Number 3. The Kia FK slash Hyundai FK At the Hydrogen Wave Forum on September 7, 2021, Hyundai Motor Group showcased a brand new hydrogen FCEV concept car with the name Vision FK. Although the manufacturer withheld the brand name, we are certain that it's not a Genesis model. It's more likely to be a Kia Vision FK, as it resembles a Stinger design progression. In contrast to all other passenger hydrogen FCEVs that we have seen so far, the Vision FK ID is distinctive. This is due to two-door sports car being an FCEV hydrogen plug-in hybrid. It combines a plug-in motor that powers the rear wheels with a fuel cell energy converter. The Vision FK can complete a 0-60 sprint in less than 4 seconds because to its system power of more than 500 kilowatts. Additionally, the range is pretty excellent. HMG anticipates it to travel more than 600 kilometers, which is roughly 373 miles. The Vision FK prototype presents an interesting challenge for the company's engineers, while also being a little of technical overkill. According to Albert Biermann, former president and head of HMG's R&D division, the company, which owns a 12% interest in Remok Automobili, created its incredible complex power electric system together. However, all other systems had to be developed internally. Although HMG hasn't officially announced the release of a production version, the fact that the prototype appears to be far more advanced than just the design study suggests that there is a genuine desire to put this car on the market. Number 2. The Kia Carnival FCEV According to reports, Kia is preparing a HEV, a BEV and even a hydrogen FCEV car as part of its all-out electrification of the carnival. According to the article makeyoung.com, Kia intends to begin manufacturing hydrogen FCEVs in 2027. According to the South Korean magazine, it will start out with military uses before launching a carnival FCEV. It appears that the carnival's hydrogen fuel cell electric powertrain will be first made, made, made available in the fifth generation of the vehicle, and not the present one. Number 1. The Land Rover Defender Fuel Cell Vehicle 
A hydrogen FCEV version of the Land Rover Defender is being considered by Jaguar Land Rover. Under Project Zeus, the British automaker created a prototype for a feasible study. A hydrogen fuel cell electric defender could complement the fully better battery powered electric defender that is apparently also under development. The Land Rover Defender hydrogen prototype was unveiled by Dr. Prat Parama on June 28, 2022 at the Symposium of Hydrogen and Fuel Cells here and now. Dr. Rama was then Jaguar Land Rover's group leader for hydrogen powertrain at the time. He was appointed senior manager of the company's hydrogen fuel cells in September 2022. Project Zeus is uh, a project which costs around uh, 21.1 million US dollars, with the Evans Propulsion Center UK con contributing 10.5 million uh, dollars, which is roughly half of that investment. On LinkedIn, Gareth Potter, project manager for Jaguar's Land Rover hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicle, shared a photo that illustrates the assembly and packing of the Land Rover Defender FCEV Essentials parts. It reveals that the pure electric Defender features an all-wheel drive drivetrain configuration made possible by two 147 kW motors and a 16.7 kWh battery pack with a 340 kW power output. The latter is hidden beneath the car's floor. Jaguar Land Rover is turning to hydrogen fuel cell technology to create zero emissions versions of its larger, longer range SUVs, including models that customers would use in harsh situations. Benefits include high energy density, quick refueling, and mi minimum range loss in low temperatures. Did you enjoy this video? Then please like and subscribe for more of the best new vehicle videos here at Finest Vehicles. Which one would you like to own? Give your opinion in the comments.